Hello everyone, welcome back to Doom. Sorry, there's been such a hiatus, things have happened. There was a mild bout of illness, there was a lot of stuff going on in the house. We're in a new office now, which is why all the sounds seem so horribly reverberating, and I have completely forgotten what I'm doing. I remember there was a big fight with Manky Buddies in there, uh, and we're in hell, which is cool. Um, I mean, it's probably not. In fact, it's probably literally the opposite of cool in every respect. However, it's cool in the sweet sense. It's cool in the, dude, I'm totally in hell. And we're getting out. Uh, like, who was the last person who went into hell and got out? Well, probably the last Doom Marine, I guess. Um, yeah, so it's been a bit of hiatus according to the save file. It's been literally a month since I last played. I last played on the 1st of this month. It's now the 30th of August, which I know is literally a month for that. That's February, okay? February is literally a month, and that is literally the length of February. Apologies if you hear any weird noises off. Jen is also in this room. Say hi, Jen. Hi. Hi. Shush, Jen. You're making noises. Um, so she flipped the bird at me. She's birds flipping the birds. Um, she tends to mutter, she says. <laughs> Don't giggle. Right, what are we doing here? Let's play this game. Um, I found a door, which I can't open, but it looks sweet as all heck. Well, so it's all hell. Come on, don't don't baby the language. You know, say what you mean. Here's another one, which I remember in the last episode I was talking about how that looks really cool because of how it resembles the original Doom stuff, which is um, something I like about this game. Is every now and then you get a glimpse of the good old-fashioned dooming. Uh, however, these are entirely new. I see a what is presumably a blue skull key. Um, but I'm not quite sure where I'm going. Let's check the map. Let's check the missions. Let's check our brains for sanity. What is that? That's a door which presumably we have to get to. Find the exit portal marked by the UAC, which is down there. Hell is very regimented. Can't help but notice. I also notice that there is the thing. Is this the right? Is this the thing? This is the thing. And then we can get up here. And then we can get up here. I have remembered we've got jump boots. Uh, everybody needs a good pair of jump boots. If you haven't got one, try Primark. This is where we came in. It's been a long time, but I do remember this is where we came in. Typical Bethesda, things loading just as you get around a corner, pretending they were there all along. Is this where we're going? No. <laughs> Guys. Friends. Romans. Quadrupeds. That was um, several different things, all referenced in very short order, none of which was related to the other. I don't know what guys would be from, it's just pretty generic, isn't it? Then there was obviously Julius Caesar's friends, Romans, countrymen. Someone tell me that's not Julius Caesar, and is in fact somebody similar to, but not the same as Julius Caesar. Um, I, s I see on the map, there is a... Is it the blue door? I don't know what I'm looking at. I can't remember what we did, and I can't remember how we go to where we need to be. The um, the information things are not particularly helpful. Uh, right. This is the part of the episode where your gracious host ums and ahs a whole bunch and has no freaking idea what he's doing, and then everyone in the comments is yelling at him. I can see that we can maybe get onto that. Oh, we can. None onto that. Oh, he's done it. Yes, back of the net. Right. Go through here. No. Please. Pretty pleased with sugar and cherries. I can see the um, Argent symbol down there. Stop readjusting this map, though. It's very stressful. I presume it's behind that blue door, then, right? Don't hurt. Fell over. Probably didn't hurt. Too hard for it to be hurt. This guy don't get nowhere in. Unless he's been attacked by you know, legions of hellspawn. It only happens once in a while, though. Uh, pick something up. Where shall I go now? Please. What's this? Click on it. Cycle objectives, yes. We basically just want to keep going down. It says the objective is in the middle of where we were, but I was there. Like, right here. Oh, we have to go around here. Ah, it's hidden. It's just naughty, isn't it? Press E. Okay. Crunchy skull thingy. Apparently some sort of waypoint, I suppose. Right, what did that do? 
We have made headway in progress. We can also go in here, pick this up. So things have changed. This will be a red skull key? Green skull key? Yellow skull. Well, it looked red on account of how it was red. Um, which means I'd probably go over here. To that door that we were looking at earlier and yonder. That's, um... Here? Right. I mean, that makes sense. That's how it would have worked in the original game. I understand that they just didn't have the graphics potential. Also, who wants to write more than one, like, logic code for how a door opens, you know? Yellow key. Doesn't matter if it's a skull or a... Just a key card. Thank you for this. We should check this, actually. What sort of upgrades do we have available to us? We have one um, Praetor suit thingy, but we have two weapon thingies, too. Which actually may not be enough for anything. One more on those. I'm not really using the pistol. I am using the super shotgun, which means we get uranium coating. And again, I still don't understand how these work, so can you please tell me? I might just Google it. Uh, the mastery challenge on those, because I've been spending a long time playing the game and I've yet to actually have a mastery challenge. Ooh. Demonic voice. over there, he's talking to me. Umbral Plains. That guy goes on a bit, doesn't he? So some guy has named the Doomslayer because he was wronged by a whole bunch of other things that are not called the Doomslayer. Whatever. Kill this. Kill this. There is going to be combat. Why am I sniping? This is Doom. You run in all guns blazing and hope for the best. I have remembered how to play the game, which makes me feel happy. Uh, we should check our missions. I'm not sure if this is the right time. Does the game pause when you're in the map? Hmm? 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 Oh, 42% health did point out that um, it's the direction you attack them from, not where you're aiming at when you do the... The takedown? Oh, hello. So, trying to do a right leg takedown whilst aiming at the right leg was apparently not the right way of doing it. So you might be forgiven for thinking that it was. Uh, we should do this. Ow. I need health, not... Kill that, give me some HP, please. There is an option that I find the... Uh use the chainsaw on these things to get some health and ammo, but I think we're okay. Do have a bit of an overcharge on my HP, so that must be something I did in the past and forgot about. Where are you? There you are. This thing is spawning them, I remember. It's not quite the uh, good old-fashioned... Um, oh, we haven't got any ammo. Ah, jeez. Rocket launcher. Where are you? It's not quite the good old-fashioned... Um, Ah, damn it. What's it called in the old game? Damn! You know the one I'm thinking of. Uh-oh. Help! <laughs> Get me out of here! Um, 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 um... The one that respawned the enemies. Ooh, that was nice. That's what we need to see. Oh, God. Kill it. HP. Oh, leg it. <laughs> it's hard. You missed, you noob. That was the last mistake you'll ever make. I need to um, probably chainsaw these mofos. That seems like the best way of restocking us. Oh. He was next to me. He squished me. Low from checkpoint. Yeah, what, what's the thing I'm going to do? Exit to desktop. What do I look like? A wuss. So I hope the sound isn't too reverberating in here. We need to get a few um, towels on the walls. 
I know what you're thinking. Towels on the walls, are you insane? First of all, yes. Second of all, you should totally check out a YouTube video, which Jen will now write down to remind me to uh, what? find. What I YouTube video about making sound panels out of towels. I will link it in the description because it's a pretty good video and we probably are going to make it ourselves at some point in the future. We could totally do that as an episode. Could totally do that as an episode. Jen has good ideas. I'll keep uh, effing these things. I call it effing them because first of all it f's the heck out of them and second of all you press F to do it. So that seems pretty um, pretty good mnemonic in case you've forgotten how to you know, ruin these enemies' days. Uh, you press F to F them up. Help, leave me alone. Get out of here. Picking up stuff. It's all good. It's all good, man. Low HP again. You don't have to get health down quick, do you? That's what we want to see. There we go. Get that. Good. Get your chainsaw out. Chainsaw this bastard. Not enough ammo for that. Oh no. Right. Shoot it. Good. Thank you for the thing. I didn't mean to press G. I meant to press F. I don't want to guck them up. Jeez Louise game. I really like the grabbing onto ledges mechanic. I really think Unreal Tournament could have done with that to be honest. Heavy assault rifle. You know the ones I mean. They resurrected the baddies. That's 42% <laughs> health. Again, 42% gamer. There must be something that is similar to 42% gaming that makes my brain think it makes sense. Um, there's a lot of polygon saving in a game like this, which means that any unused enemies and corpses will be... the disintegrate. You've seen that um, many games, actually. It's not just... Doom, but there's a lot of games where corpses will just disintegrate over time. And it's entirely because we need the polygons. We need to be able to render more. Get in there. Good. Ah, jeez. How many of them can there possibly be? Without giving me any blinking chainsaw ammo, though. That's the thing. Got rockets. Well, rockets it is, even though that was a terrible idea last time. Oh, hello. They keep getting behind me again. Have you seen this? It's just not on. That is a difficult fight. Let's have a look at our um, objectives. We need to have a look at what we're going to do. Press F1 and F2 to cycle your active... We do have equipment. We should remember that. Um, we can use a hologram now. So we, let's, have, let's have a look. See what we've got. Press space to continue. We are currently using the hologram. What do you press? I forgot how to throw it, though. How am I supposed to do that? I forgot how to play the game. 120 HP is our max. Not really doing too well on that. Um... Earn four Praetor tokens, okie dokie. Kill ten demons while using power-ups. So we're about to walk into a place which is unmapped, which is not funny. Uh, yeah, leg sweep, attack right leg. You see, so I think what it actually means is attack from the right. Oh, you know what we should do? This is where we should do this. There we go. Start off properly. Start like you mean to go on, huh? So now, how much chance around have we got? None. So it didn't give us any, which is a bit of a shame. Just kind of hoping that it I'm assuming that you don't drop chainsaw ammo from the chainsaw. That wouldn't make much sense at all. But, you know, it might have its own little economy thing going on that's worth trying once in a while. Where is the summoner? Get off me! You're not my type. Pick these up. Ugh. Trouble is, I'm using those HPs so quickly. So soon after I um start this combat, but you're getting stuck on little things like that as well. What was that I got stuck on? Oh, ah, no. 
Now I'm falling down. That is not in the wheelhouse of good things to be happening to me right now. I saw that. Yes. I really think we need to concentrate on these summoners, even though that is a massive issue. I don't even know if that was a leg sweep. <laughs> I'm, just, uh, I'm attacking them with the FU button because it's the most efficient way of recharging all my bits. Um, mostly ammo, but it does drop health as well. For once, ammo is the problem, although the fact that I keep dying may suggest that that is not entirely as obvious as you'd think. Ah, it was a death! I thought I was doing the stabby! I need to remember how to fire the... The hologram. Not doing well on this particular episode. Look, it's going to be 20 minutes of me dying. I hope you're up for that. Is it C? It might be C. Let's just let's just go into settings and have a quick look. Mouse and keyboard. Key bindings. Use equipment. Mouse 3. How many escape buttons are there? So we're going to do this. We're going to do this. Start making a mess of these jokers. So I'm pretty sure I've got the uh, explosive shell equipped here. If you do a glory kill, which is also known as F them up button, um, and they're not ready for it, you end up stepping into their range, which is a bit punishing, to say the least. Got to get in range. I think it was a left leg. I assume it just means you attack them from the right, right? It's nice of them to telegraph where that attack's going. Also, I'm not sure what I've got um, set up in my secondary slot on here. It may be that there's nothing. I don't know if we have a secondary slot at all. Let's shut this now. There we go. You'll attack that. I'm going over here. Feels a little bit like I'm copying out, but honestly, sometimes you've got to, got to do it. That was an excellent grenade from my uh, shotgun, if I do say so myself. Yes. The more glory kills we get, the more we can sustain this insane level of damage, I guess. Also, every now and then, it's nice to just <laughs> take stock. Goodness. This thing teleporting around is super dangerous. Because you can't... I apologise for anybody getting motion sickness from my constant swinging around, by the way. But you have to keep looking behind you to make sure that you're not allowed to be about to be ganked by some joker who thinks he's funny. Like that bastard there. I didn't even get the chance to glory kill this son of a bee. Ow! Get this out. Sort it. Nice. I mean, if you overkill him, it seems like you get um, a little bit of reward as well, so... It's not the end of the world if we don't manage to F button them, but I would like to. I managed to save those ones for a little bit longer this time too. I got low health somehow. I teleported into that, which kind of is takes your own medicine, mate. You, know, you teleport into me with your bullshit skills. Yeah, I really think Unreal Tournament would have been excellent with the uh, ledge grab. And the, the way that they've implemented it is just so seamless here that... Um, I think it would have been really, really nice. I remember playing Unreal itself, and there was a section where you run up a big spiral staircase. Forgot about the stun on this, actually. Wow. That nearly was bad for me. Let me out. Will you take enough damage to be glory killable? Thank you. And you. Brilliant. Next snap. Fine. Wasn't what I wanted, but it does the job. This thing does telegraph its attack, but oh my god, you have to be out. <laughs> Paying attention to the attack, as well as the telegraph of the attack. No ammo on this, no ammo on that. Come on. Wow. Careful. Try and not waste too much ammo on this. Do you want to... Yeah, you don't want to overkill it, you want to get that glory kill in. Give yourself the best chance of a little bit of extra HP and ammo coming out of the back of it. There you are. 
That hurt. Let me out. Good. Good place to be. Can I use this again yet? Yes. Oh! Straight through me like a chainsaw. Did really well there. Looks like... Uh, I whacked the microphone, by the way, because it's in another new position. We like it when we change the position of our microphone. Go to the dossier. It's called a dossier, by the way, that thing that tells us where we are and what to do. Maybe we save our chainsaw for um, a a weaker enemy during the fight. So I want to just use my assault rifle on these buggers. Because these things can give you a bunch of stuff from just a simple glory kill, which is easy enough to achieve because you just shoot them occasionally and then, you know, press F. So I think we save our chainsaw for like an imp halfway through the fight. When things get a little bit hectic, we use our... Maybe we use it early. Let's use it early. Put that there. Get it recharging. Get it on the uh, on the down low. There's my dude. Right. So I'm not sure what my right click attack is on the uh, super shotgun here, but I'm going to use the actual shotgun and get a grenade or two in here. Help. Oh, I'm on a thing that I didn't know about. Sweet. Let's not use that just yet. We don't need it. Help. That's what I wanted. So I'm glad I didn't have to waste the uh, the time in the the weapon circle there trying to figure out which weapon I should be using. It'd be really nice if when you were close to something you could just break its neck. Ooh, hello. Don't like this thing simply because it keeps moving so damn much. We need to use bullets on these because the travel time on the uh, on that thingy there is just a bugger. Which is a polite way of saying it. Kill it. Perfect. Ah! Run away. Wow. Don't know what I dodged there, but somehow I did. This game is harder than deathmatch. And I'm bad at deathmatch. When I go online, I'm terrible at it. All my mates have shitted it too, so I beat the crap out of them, but... Deathmatch itself is pretty hard. I don't know about this game in particular, but in general, just other people are better than me at every game I ever play. So, I suck at deathmatch. Oh, shiznit. See, I'm trying to run away and get these things, but... You can't always tell about the telegraphs of those spawner thingies because you have to ooh, you have to be able to see the tele you have to see the telegraph go by to know to dodge it it's a really hard battle this might end up being a between the episodes I fought this battle and by the way it's the middle of the damn night okay I haven't played this game for ages and I thought I'm gonna do an episode which I am this is me doing it you can see it Um, and I should be in bed, you know. Honestly, I feel quite on the ball right now, which is interesting. Wow, look at that. See, that's talking about it. That wasn't on the ball. Nice. There's a bunch of stuff for me to collect up here if I so desire. Um, but yeah, I'm feeling pretty okay about this. Normally, I'm just making stupid mistakes. Just uh, did really well on the daily on the Binding of Isaac as well, and a beat a challenge. So, it's hard to be salty. Where you at? Did that thing actually get stunned by that? A few more um, plasma ammos then is going to be good, because I definitely want to be stunning things as much as possible. Put this down here, see if anything gets baited by it. Ah, motherland! <laughs> Did that from a double jump. <gasps> it's fun. Uh, no. Leave me alone. Run through here. Get out of the way. Um, I seem to be adrenaline the heck out of this ammo. Jen, why are you making all that noise? Because I'm hungry. She's hungry? Was that one toast you've had all day not enough for you? 
I just got a weapon mastery cluster strike. Does that mean that I've been doing it right all this time? It's just not been tracking my progress for some reason. I'm okay with the idea, but I'm not like, too pleased about it. Like, I'm happy that we achieved something. Um, I need to use this and get some ammo for it. Where is that thing? There is that thing. Stop shooting me, it's not fair. Why are you attacking the wall, mate? Doesn't make sense. <gasps> he's dead! He was looking down to see if he's pressing F and not G. And he's dead. <laughs> it's a long episode of me dying a lot. <coughs> oh, Apologise for the coughing and for the terrible gameplay right now. Look, it's interesting. Okay? It's fun. You like it. 120. My max is not 120. I see. Let's go and see if we can find some more. Um... What's Jen bringing back? Crisps. Squares. Cheese. Best crisps. Cheese and onion squares. That's a... Uh, I mean... Can you wab wobble in the mic. So the microphone's attached to Jen's desk, so if you can hear typing... Um, it's literally because... Apparently banging chair. And whacking about and just being a general miver. Because Because of Jen. All things are because of Jen. Except for, you know, nice things. Um, oh. That's chips, by the way, for American people. So they're not really chips because... I always got the impression that crisps covers more of a, a gamut of snack foods than the concept of a chip, because a chip is surely, you know, and the, the specific sliced potato, a chipped potato, which is why we call chips chips, because they are chipped potatoes. Oh, you gave me ammo, thank you. Um, I always imagine crinkle cut. But when you like, say like chips. McCoy's level chips. McCoy's level chips, that is a very high quality chip. But like, you know, the style one. You mean, um, chops? Yeah. Like, English chips, McCoy's chips. So McCoy's is oven oven fries for American listeners. No, no, no. Oh, that's McCain, sorry. McCoy's yeah. are... Crisps, though. McCoy's are crinkle cut chips to the American listener and crisps to the English listener. But of course we have other snack foods that are not chips because these are sort of some weird you know uh, what even are they? <laughs> Let's just talk about this. So, uh, presumably they used to be a potato. That's that's where I'm going to begin with this. Jen's going to read the information off of the packet for the re listeners at home who then don't have to go out and figure out the discrepancies between English and American snack food naming. They are a square potato snack. Oh my god, I jumped over it and then I stomped on its head. Which cannot be... Leave me alone. Help. Cannot be reproduced. Uh, set no limitations. So, what? <laughs> they are a potato snack. A square potato snack. Yes, a square meal. Good square meal. Let's put this guy here. Make sure that he drags some aggro away from us. Snack with angles. Angles? Yeah. Well, we're angles, Anglo Saxons, right? Well, you're not. Yeah, uh, actually, I'm not either, I guess. I'm a uh, Viking descent, which is not very Anglo at all. In fact, it's my fault that the Anglo Saxons aren't the thing anymore. We've done it! We're not only going to be the best at this game. We also earned a weapon upgrade point from having amazing combat skills. Well, that's a half hour-ish thanks for sticking with the series episode. I hope James is still uploading Hollow Knight episodes. It's been a while since I checked that as well. Aforementioned, nobody wants to do anything recently. But we're back in the game. We're back in the game. We're back in this game, which is now succumbed to my almighty power. Um, I wouldn't mind some chainsaw ammo, which I expect to find down here in the depths of hell, you know, can of oil, not remotely flammable or anything. Uh, I'm going to pick up all these things. I've got the yellow skull key. And we are going to end the episode here. Thank you for watching. Remember to check out other videos on the channel. Remember to mither Ed until he actually makes some damn videos and stops whinging about the walls in his house, which is where he chose to live, because obviously everybody chooses to live where they live and don't have any, you know, autonomy over anything. Um... It would be nice if I'd made a few videos. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Check out the next episode, and I hope that it will be sooner rather than later. But until then, stick with us. Don't die. I like it when you watch.
Doesn't sound at all dodgy. 